Hello, 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 everyone. Welcome to Wine and Wellness Wednesday. I'm Lindsay Brantley. I am the founder of Camellia Elise and the Camellia Elise Academy. And I'm super excited to be here with you guys today. So as is customary, before I do anything else, I hope you guys have your glass of wine. I just want to toast to you and hope that you are having an amazing week so far. We made it through hump day, so let's toast to that first. Okay, so if you're new to Wine and Wellness Wednesday, every week on the At Camellia Academy page, I go live on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and I talk to you guys about everything business-wise when it comes to building your own spa empire, beauty empire, body sculpting empire, whatever it is. And a lot of the times I talk to you guys about specific, you know, marketing, growing your team, business, whatever it is. But for those of you who know that we have a body sculpting academy, we also teach very specific techniques for body sculpting. And I've done a behind the scenes video on some of the cavitation machines. Let me put this up for one second. I've done a couple of behind the scenes on our cavitation machines. I've done a couple um, on behind the scenes for wood therapy, but today I kind of wanted to talk to you guys about body wraps. So if you know me, I'll tell you right away, I'm not going to certify you to do body wraps via YouTube, right? Like I don't do that. Like I'm not going to take a 20 and 40 page manual and turn it into a 15 minute, you know, conversation. But I want to give you guys just some background and some information in regards to um, the technology, different types of wraps. So I'm just going to briefly go over the three types of wraps that we learn in class and then some of the different materials. So the first thing is I'm actually sitting on the infrared bed now. And the funny thing is I'm having wine and telling you all this. But if you've ever been in one of my classes, you know the one thing I say is these are all detox services. Don't drink alcohol, but I'm not doing the service today, so I'm going to have my wine, okay? But anyway, so um, I'm sitting on the infrared blanket, so I'm going to show that to you guys. So this is just um, when people talk about like what is an infrared blanket, what is infrared equipment. So this is an actual sauna blanket that we utilize to help clients burn calories, burn body fat. Um, they do sweat off water weight, but they also um, increase their metabolism and burn calories. Um, and we do that utilizing special creams, um, special temperatures on the machines. But um, there's two different kinds of infrared machines. And so the one that I'm sitting on, the one that I have now, is called a two-zone machine. So. What you'll see, I'm just going to turn the box on really quickly. Oh, I didn't plug it up. Never mind. Um, I'll plug it up in a minute. But um, what you'll see is that there are two places for temperatures. So you actually have um, two settings. So this one has a top and a bottom layer that heats up. There's also a three-zone bed. So a three-zone bed, um, instead of having a top and a bottom heat element, it actually has a bottom, a middle, and an upper. So that's what makes, that's one of the things that makes it different is that it actually has three heating elements, three different temperature settings. So that's one. The second thing is most two-zone beds have a zipper. So clients get in and you zip them in inside. Well, most three-zone beds, I typically say are for our larger clientele because instead of zipping them up, you actually normally Velcro around them. So if they need, you know, a wider space, then the three zone bed might be better for the client. So those are the two typically, um, two different types of machines. There's also like an infrared where a person sits in it, but those are not as comfortable um, and they don't heat up quite as well. So I typically stick to the infrared blankets when we're teaching infrared. Um, and then the second type of wrap that we learn about in our body wrap class is a contour body wrap. So the first one's more for weight loss. The second one is more for inch loss. When you're doing a contour body wrap, you can use two primary different types of material. And the first one is going to be elastic. So you guys may have seen like elastic bandages, nice and stretchy, you know, um, where you see people that are kind of wrapped up like mummies. 
that's you know one way that you can wrap someone the second one is going to be with a medical grade plastic um, that's what we teach in class you may have also seen that people use instead of medical grade plastic they use like that longer um, seaweed based wrap we use medical grade plastic for different reasons I'm not going to go into it but we definitely get better results um, every piece of material that you use when you're doing body wraps matters you should not be using saran wrap on your clients um, like I said we use a very specific medical grade plastic because it works better it does some different things we go into that in class but um you shouldn't be using saran wrap i don't really recommend the seaweed wrap and then even the size of the roll so we have two different roll sizes not going to go into that right now but um the elastic if you look at uh, the elastic bandage versus the contour roll you'll see that this one is longer than the plastic there's a reason for that when we do contouring we need the shorter roll not going to go into that right now but everything that you do when you are wrapping it matters how you hold the roll matters uh the temperature of the machine matters like there is a science behind every single thing that you do so when you're looking at classes and trying to figure out okay who do i go to what do i want to learn there's questions that you need to ask like there's nothing wrong with saying what kind of infrared bed do you guys give me um, or, you know, do we go over temperature settings or, you know, do you guys show me how to do the contouring techniques? Um, if you ever like see people's videos on, um, on their pages and like they have a, per a model that's like standing there and going around in circles and, or the, the person who's rapping is like walking around in circles. It's not actually creating tension. That person is basically like just going around in circles wrapping someone when they should. Like I teach my girls, like you stand in one place, you pull things strategically so that you add tension in certain areas and you release tension in certain areas. So everything that you do when you are contouring someone's body, it does matter. So I always say, like, take your time to figure it out. Um, that's one of the reasons people ask all the time. Are your classes virtual or your classes virtual? Some of our classes are virtual. We do offer a 100% virtual detox specialist class. We do a 100% virtual um, wood therapy class. But our body wrap classes and our laser lipo classes, those are not 100%. Um, virtual, not yet. I haven't figured out how to do it yet because... When I'm teaching you how to do certain techniques, I need to be able to see it, to touch it, feel it. Um, and then when I'm teaching you laser lipo, I don't want you burning the client. I, I guide your hand with certain things. So there's a reason that, you know, we don't do things kind of like other people do. And I'm okay with that. There is definitely um, a technique to everything. There's a science behind everything. And I really did take my time when... I developed the curriculums and even the trainers that I train, I spend even more time with them, like going over every single thing and why it matters. So um, I hope that that gave you guys just a little bit of insight. Like I said, it's two primary types of wraps. You have your infrared wrap where you utilize your infrared machine. Um, and like I said, it's certain temperatures for certain things. Good, we go into that in class. But certain temperatures for certain parts of the machine, certain things you're trying to do. So that's infrared, and then you have the um, contouring wrap, which is using special um, special bands and bandages and to um, give inch loss. And then the third one is actually a combination, where you wrap certain body parts with the plastic, and then you go into the bed so that you're getting inch loss and weight loss and burning body fat. So those are the three types of wraps that we learned about, and these are the primary um, pieces of equipment. Obviously, there are more pieces of equipment that go into wrapping, but this is just kind of the body wrap 101 version so that you guys can see, you know, one what a couple of things are that we learned in that body wrap certification class. So I hope that um, this helped you guys out a little bit, gave you a little bit of insight into um, the body wrap class, some of the things that we do teach. If you guys have any questions, as always, feel free to um, direct message us, email us, call us. We're always available um, either way, but feel free to call us if you have questions about the body wrap class or the laser lipo class or any of the other ones. 
but I just kind of wanted to give you guys a basic overview of the body wrap so you would have an idea of what we learned in class. So hope that that helps a little bit and I'm super excited to come back next week, talk about another topic or two. And if you have any questions in the meantime about the program, the you know supplies, anything, just feel free to reach out to us. And as, like I said, as is customary every week, I want to toast as we end the night. Toast to each and every one of you guys for making it through a hump day. We're almost through the week. The weekend is almost here. So y'all enjoy your evening and I'll see you next week. All right.